Hello. This is the pour again. It's June 12th, I believe. It's like, uh, it's a 448. I braided my hair. I know I've been missing in action for a week. I spent two days braiding my hair so I can get up in the morning and not worry about looking crazy. I like to just get up and go. I don't want to be bothered with my hair. But yes, I did it myself. Like it. Is it cute? Took me two days. <laughs> anyway, I'm doing this video in response to YouTuber Two Pounds Too Many. So that's the number two pounds too many. He um, wrote a comment saying that I inspired him and um, that really touched my heart because it lets me know that I'm not just doing this for nothing and I'm so glad that I could inspire somebody and of course there's so many people who have inspired me so he wanted to know more about colon cleansing so um, what can I say there's several ways to do it I mean colon cleansing is like kind of like using using an enema it's um, there's several way to, ways to do it you could of course take colon cleansing products um, like for instance, Dr. Schultz, I love his stuff. Um, my light is bling blinging so strong until it's us. Uh, Dr. Schultz is spelled um, S C H U L Z E apostrophe S. So you can go online. He has a website, uh, www.herbdoc.com. It's just. Um, one of many, you know, you can go to your health food store and find so many different products. I actually did a whole body cleanse this time. Um, this light, it's a whole body cleanse, uh, internal cleansing system. It's a complete uh, kit by um, en Enzymatic Therapy. And the thing about uh, colon cleansing is um, basically when you eat food like your meats and stuff like that it it undigested food you know g goes into your colon and, and it, it just sits there you know you're supposed to when you eat food it's supposed you're supposed to take the nutrients from the food and then it's supposed to whatever you don't use is supposed to waste out you know in the bathroom in the toilet and sometimes we don't you know because of the kind of foods that we're eating like we have meat and stuff sitting in our colon and stuff like that and it just sits there and rots and a lot of mucus build up and stuff like that so with cleaning the colon you're basically you know flushing that stuff out you know they believe that sometimes you have like 10 to 15 pounds of undigested food just sitting there in your colon um, so, um, with also along with the, doing the colon cleanse, like taking it orally, you can also do something which is called the, uh, colonic irrigation. And I've had that done. And that's when you go in, um, what do you call them? Colonic therapist? Well, anyway, you go into, um, this place that does colonics and, you know, just do a search for one in your town. Um, you go in and they insert this tube into your rectum, your anus, your butt, your bum, whatever you want to call it. And the idea is they flush um, your large intestine, your colon, with uh, 20 gallons of water. And as that water is going in, it, the contents, whatever is sitting there in your body and in your colon is coming out into another tube so you're lying there on the table and you can see everything that's passing out of you <laughs> I know it's disgusting but it's talking about it but you know we need to talk about it you know so many people get colon cancer and so much stuff and so anyway if you got all this uh, this undigested food sitting in there yeah you know it's it, you're carrying that weight you know if it's 10 pounds 15 pounds 20 pounds whatever so when I was talking about you know kick things off with a colon cleanse yeah uh, get a fresh start uh, if you if you are overweight nine times out of ten you got stuff sitting in your in your colon and some companies or you could go to some, I was looking at some website 
I forgot the name of it. But anyway, just do a Google search. They have some websites up where they're showing how people have passed parasites out of their bodies. So, oh, that's not funny, but, ooh, you know. So it's so good to do a colon cleanse because you have no idea sometimes what's sitting in your body. So, I mean, as you guys can see, you know, I started, what, two weeks ago? I lost, like, six pounds, like, the first week. Actually, it was seven pounds, but I think because it was, like, 235.8 or something, I just said six. But, and the most of that is water weight. And, but I'm sure with me doing this colon cleanse and, and flushing out my system and, you know, you're supposed to have, like, three bowel movements a day. And if you're not having that, then you definitely have stuff sitting in your colon. So clean it out. <laughs> Go ahead and clean it out and get started. Start over. Start fresh. And, you know, you need to be moving your bowels at least three times a day. So if you're not doing that, mm Go get a colonics. Go get a colon cleanse. And uh, so I will see you guys. I, I hope this helped you. Um, <laughs> funny subject, but yeah, I hope it helped you. And, I, you know, I'm glad you really asked about it because I'm thinking I need to go and get a, a colonics done. I haven't done one in a while. I just did a colon cleanse or whatever with the, the um, whole body cleanse or whatever. But I'm, I'm definitely into that kind of thing. So... Anyway, thanks again for subscribing to my channel, and thank you so much for the wonderful comment. Like I said, it makes me feel like I'm not doing this, you know, just to be doing it. So, um, you know, anybody else that watches the video, if I've helped you or whatever, please feel free to uh, rate and comment and uh, send a video response or whatever. So we're all in this thing together. So let's uh, do what we can to help each other out. And... Uh, I will see you guys on Monday when I weigh myself. But I will say, you know, don't expect the six pound loss this time, you know, because it's, you know, most of that weight was water weight and stuff like that. So now it's going to slow down to about one or two pounds a week. And that's what I'm going for anyway. So um, I'm going to go out and do my walk and um, I will see you guys uh, soon. Okay. All right. Have a good day.